We nominated the Isle of Bute Committee because they are a highly dedicated team of volunteers and friends who represent us massively on the Isle of Bute, which is in Argyll. We have been fundraising for Macmillan for 27 years. We're a very friendly crowd. Yes, we are. We, we are um, we're all yes, about the same age. age. We're all at school we're together. together. Our committee meetings, uh, there's a lot of chat and a lot of coffee and biscuits. Yes. Well, we're all asked by previous people who were on the, the committee, as each of us re retired from our respective job. Well, we have a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, we do, I definitely do. Especially fashion show and, and uh, coffee mornings, you meet a lot of people. The committee have concentrated in raising a lot of money for local grants in the area. In 2016, the committee were involved in a project to refurbish two rooms at the local Victoria Hospital. As these two rooms are created to provide palliative care to local residents on the island. It's a marvel for the island. It is. It's, it's a very good facility. Having to leave the island to go for um, treatment is, is not easy. Very often it means an overnight stay in the winter time. The boats can be very disrupted. It's lovely for families not to have to travel. They can spend more time with, with their loved ones. Funding the, the revamp of the unit, that was the first time that we've done something specific for the island. It's a very necessary part of the community to see funds being raised for something locally. Well, anything we take on, we usually put our whole heart and soul into it. Mm -hmm. And we work very hard at different things we do. And well, you can see the proceeds, it, it does pay off. Yeah. The committee have actually had a fundraising milestone this year by raising £250,000 for Macmillan Cancer Support. The impact the Isle of Butte Committee have made has been phenomenal in terms of how they have achieved so much for such a small committee so locally. Mm -hmm.